Alright, today I am just going to give you an overview of Task Manager and uh, the uh, some of the cool things you can actually do with it. So what we're going to do is we're going to go down and access it. We can do it a couple of different ways. Uh, right now I'll press Control Delete and it actually gives us the ability to start Task Manager here. Uh, this is Windows 7 and we can also access it more commonly here we use task manager uh, right clicking off of the taskbar so we'll take a look at the applications here um, we don't have anything running what we can do is we can actually run something from here so let's do something here let's uh, go ahead and run notepad alright there it is Running in there in the background. All right. So if you have a program that ever becomes non-responsive, it'll tell you right over here not responding, and you can actually end task. All right. Now that's a neat thing. You can also switch in between uh, applications. All you have to do is just select it and say switch to. Now processes. Uh, this not necessarily uh, reflects any of the applications you run yourself these are actually some of the system uh, processes right now or programs running but let's go ahead and we're going to run notepad again there it is okay it shows us right here notepad we're going to do this there we go so there's notepad uh, another thing is uh, a lot of times if you got a stubborn application in here and you can't get it to uh, end by clicking the end task go weird processes and if you actually know the the, the physical name of the uh, application you can actually kill it here just like we did before isn't that nice so those are, are some of the uh, a couple of the uses here of the processes and applications and also remember you can also run any application right here um, it gives you the ability to browse um, so uh, that's one of the great functions uh, the processes here uh, you can kill there's a couple other uh, uh, interesting items you can do here um, I'm going to go into detail later on into uh, some of these into a uh, uh, a uh, blog in regards to 64-bit uh, operating systems and uh, using the quad core but right now I want to show you just task manager and what it can do uh, in general uh, services you can also find out what services are running here you can actually find out uh, uh, who's taking up what in regards to uh, See all these here. There we go. See, we can actually find all our different services here and figure out exactly what's running, what shouldn't be running, and all the nice sorts of things. Uh, performance. We can actually see the performance of all the cores running here. We can actually see all of our, our processes and our go here. We can actually see all of our memory and the resource models. Networking, we can see our networking performance is our net, on our network connection, see if we've got good connection. And uh, we can also, if you have, um, <coughs> if you're not on a domain and you have fast user switching, you can actually go in here and uh, you can uh, uh, find out uh, who's on our name of. Uh, Who's there? What tasks are running? And you can also send the other user uh, uh, a message. So that is only available to computers that are are non-domain uh, exclusive. So that is pretty much the rundown of the use list, just right out of the box of Task Manager. So I hope you find this information useful.